Welcome to another Learn and Gain session on ITIL. In this video we will talk about service level management. What is service level management? Service level management negotiates, agrees and documents appropriate IT services targets with representatives of the business, and then monitors, and produces reports on the service provider's ability to deliver the agreed level of service. Let's look at a simple example for service level management. In this example, a person is ordering a pizza. Hello, I would like to order a large chicken pizza. Sure, we will have your chicken pizza prepared and delivered in 30 minutes. Okay, thank you. See you in 30 minutes. In this scenario, there is a mutual agreement between the customer and the service provider. This is called service level agreement. Both agreed for the 30 minute delivery timeline. Hello, here is your chicken pizza. Thank you for delivering the pizza within 30 minutes. Appreciate it. Consider a scenario where the pizza is delivered late. It took 50 minutes for the pizza to be delivered. Hey, it took 50 minutes for the pizza to be delivered. We agreed for the pizza to be delivered in 30 minutes. I understand, and I apologize. As a favor, we will have this pizza delivered free of cost. We will ensure we deliver pizza on time henceforth. For the pizza delivered on time example. 1. Customer happy. 2. Service provider happy. 3. Service provider was offered money for his service. For the pizza delivered late example. 1. Customer unhappy. 2. Service provider not happy. 3. Service provider suffered financial loss due to delay in delivery. Let's consider an example in our office space. Hello service desk, I would like to have Microsoft Office installed in my computer. Service Desk has responded that the software will be installed within two business days on the customer's computer. In the event of an incident, incident resolution timelines are agreed globally based on the priority of the incident. The Support Desk is expected to restore the incident within the agreed timelines based on the priority of the incident. In both pizza and software installation examples, the content was focused more on delivery timelines. Service levels are focused more on delivery timelines. SLA stands for Service Level Agreement. Agreement meaning there is a mutual understanding on the delivery timelines. In an IT industry this agreement forms a part of the contract. A contract is signed between the customer and the service provider on the service levels. This is called service level agreement. Reports are published to monitor the achieved service levels to the agreed service levels in the contract. The metrics are circulated to the customers and other stakeholders. Hope, we were able to provide some basic insights on service level management. For more videos, please visit www.learnandgain.in. You can also subscribe to our channel on YouTube. We will be publishing more videos on ITIL concepts. You can also follow us on facebook.com slash learn and gain. Thank you, and have a nice day.